Today in this video we will show you how to create, manage, enable and edit pre-design templates inside the Visual Customizer of Zekeke. Pre-design templates are a core feature of our platform. It allows you to offer your customers editable designs instead of having them starting from scratch to personalize your products. So you can create pre-decorated products and designs for your customers to customize. You can create designs with edible texts and images and fully define a set of customization rules and restrictions for each element of that design. You can create really complex design inside our visual customizer. You need to go inside tools and then select pre-design template. Afterwards, you need to select a product for which you want to create a template. In this case, let's select the t-shirt. Keep in mind that there are options and settings that are applied to all template and then you need to select texts, images and shapes that you want to enable or disable for all those elements. In this case, you can enable customers to choose a pre-design template as soon as the visual customizer starts. The option allows your customers to be shown a window with all the pre-design templates, so they will need to have chosen one and then start a visual customization. Let's add a new template. In this case, you need to select the template settings, give it a name and insert the tags. Select the category, for example. Then you can apply the template to all the variants. You can select to sync elements on all the product sides, if you have those. Disable the images galleries or able or disable user to add images and even select the max number of images. Then you can select the images upload options with all these formats supported by Zekeke. Then you can enable users or not to add text and even the max number of tags. Remember, if you disable all options here, you need to have your customers to only be able to modify the elements you add to design. Otherwise, they'll be free to add text and images to the products. Save the template. Then let's start adding a text and select text settings. Let's give the element a name. So you might need to assign a name to a design element in a template to identify that element. In ZKK, there are tools that use this field to work properly. For example, the name and numbers tool. Once you enable the name and numbers tools, this element, for example, will be seen inside the visual bulk variations for your products. You can check that video on our YouTube channel. Then you can take to allow users, as said here, to edit the text, move it, rotate it, resize it, or delete it, or simply not. You can select to have text mandatory to edit. You can have the duplicate, the mirror, and layers for text. Put the text always on top so that all the other elements inserted inside the design will be under the text. Then you can allow users to select the font family, the color, the font weight, if they can change the font alignment, if they want curved text, if they want a text box, the font vertical alignment, a lot of options, the letter spacing, minimum and maximum, the line spacing, the font size, if you want just upper cases, and another important option to make the text printable. If you disable printable, the text won't be included in the print ready file. If you include them inside the thumbnail, that means that you can make the text as not printable, but still show it in the product thumbnails, in the card checkout, sharing templates gallery, so that your customers still see a realistic preview of the final item. Then you can select the minimum and maximum number of characters that you allow on your product, the padded string, the shadow color, the blur, the shadow distance, the shadow angle, the padded start at the end, or both. Remember always to set the template at the end of your configuration. So we just saw how to edit all the text settings inside a pre-designed template. Now let's move on to the images. As we previously said, we can restrict and select different rules regarding images. Right now we're customizing a mug. We can upload an image, for example,
we can move around the image. But inside the settings, we need to give the element a name. And we can think allow users to replace the image, move it, or don't move it, don't rotate, don't resize, because we want the image to be just as that size, or delete, or even mandatory to edit. We can even allow users to add masks, replace and remove them, or edit them. Also, to put the image as well as the text always on top. And the same thing that we mentioned for text, make them printable so that they appear inside the print ready files or not, or included in the thumbnail. As we said previously with the text, you need to save the template in order to have that rules and that image inside the pre-designed templates. As we previously saw, we can let the pre-designed templates be shown inside the visual customizer before even the customization start. And also we can make it on default if we have variants of products, or even if we don't have variants of products, we need to click here to make it on default and see the design before the customizer opens and before the customizer starts for all customers. Another thing that we can edit inside the pre-designed templates are shapes and masks. We can give the option to customers to upload a shape max for the upload button or pick one from the shapes gallery. When we add it to the design, we can decide whether to use it simply as a shape or as a fillable shape, which means that your customers will be able to fill the shape with an image. For example, we can select the heart in this case. We can give it a color and a stroke. We can restrict moves, resize, rotation, deletion, and edit the stroke, for example, here. And we can select, again, the shape setting. We can put it mandatory to edit. Or, for example, the move, rotation, and resize image in the shape. We can put it always on top and, again, make it printable or just include it inside the thumbnail. We marked as a fillable shape, so we can let the customers fill the shape with an image. By the end of the day, the pre-designed templates are really a core feature of the Zekeka Visual Commerce platform. It can be a game changer for your visual customization offer for your products. No matter which type of catalog you have, how many variants do you manage? If you have got more than one pre-designed template, you can enable customers to initialize a pre-designed product so that customers will be shown the window, select the design, and start a new unique visual commerce experience. So no matter if you sell shirts with different sizes or variants, you can select to offer design for mugs or business cards, no matter the product no matter the catalog that you manage, you can select to create a pre-decorated product for your customers.